With the refugees mapped, now I can map the countries with IDPs numbering over 250,000, so I can bring special attention to those countries on the map. As I've already assigned a fill color to each country, I need to get creative in how I can show which countries have over 250,000 IDPs. Whenever you have a polygon on top of a polygon, it creates a cartographic challenge. I'll overlay a hatcher on the countries with IDP values to solve this problem. So I'll begin by duplicating this UNHCR layer. I'll right click on it and choose duplicate. I'll double click on the properties and I will rename this layer high IDP and click OK. I'll double click on the layer to open up the layer properties and go to the style tab and I'll change the column from refugees to IDPs. Then I'll select these classes and click delete to remove the existing classes and I'll click the add class button to add a single class. I'll double click on the values to enter the class bounds for this class and I'll enter a lower bound of 250,000 and I'll enter the upper bound as 474,096 which is the highest IDP value. I'll click OK and I'll change the class name to more than 250,000 IDPs. Finally I'll double click on the symbol to open up the symbol selector. I'll select simple fill and from the symbol layer type I'll choose a line pattern fill. I'll reduce the distance to 2 and I'll select the line symbol and change the color to a hue of 0, saturation of 0, and a value of 0. And click OK. And while I'm here I'll change the width of this to 0.25. Click OK to accept that change and click OK. Let me turn this layer on and drag it to the top of the layers panel as the uppermost layer. In the next task, I'll create a legend and export the map.